the topic is subsection of vector we have two vector a and b and uh, we are to find out that is our aim is to find out a minus b now a minus b can be written like this one a in bracket plus minus b in bracket okay what is minus b minus b is the negative b vector minus b is negative b vectors means any vector that is suppose that b is the vector if its direction is reversed only direction is is reversed then it will be called a negative b vector okay now next in the diagram here we are finding out um, there is a a this horizontal line is a vectors and this line is b vectors so from the law of parallelogram of vector addition the diagonal this diagonal will be a plus b is equal to r resultant okay now here a and b is making uh, an angle theta with each other now b is produced in backward direction to find out the minus b vector here in broken line i have uh, represented it minus b now again this a and this minus b okay in the lower part if we complete a parallelogram in the lower part by taking a and minus b we will get such like a structure in the lower part as one in the broken lines okay and this will be the diagonal this will be the diagonal and this diagonal will be the resultant of a and b minus b vectors now here a and minus b vectors are making an angle 180 degree minus theta theta with each other not theta it's 180 degree minus theta now what is this a plus minus b this is the thing that we are aiming to find out this is a minus b here let us suppose a minus b that is a plus minus b is equal to r where r is the resultant now this is resultant r is the resultant magnitude now r <coughs> is the modulus of a minus b modulus of a minus now r that is the resultant the square of the resultant is will be given by a square plus b square plus 2ab cos 180 degree minus theta here minus b sign should be used over here but minus b squaring of minus b will give them plus b square so i haven't uh, shown it over here now the angle is not theta it's cos it's 180 degree minus theta and cos 180 degree minus theta is just equal to minus cos theta so the expression becomes a square plus b square minus 2ab cos theta now the next topic uh, next point is to find out the angle angle the tan alpha will be given by the, this one here if you will replace the 180 degree minus theta by theta we will get the original expression as uh, we found out uh, in our derivation of parallelogram of vector addition but here 180 degree minus theta should be used because the angle between a and uh, minus b is 180 degree minus theta now 180 degree minus theta is just a uh, sign of 180 degree minus theta is uh, just sin theta and the cos of 180 degree minus theta is that is just minus cos theta so the expression becomes this one and the angle is with the a that is original direction of a the a has a direction horizontal okay thank you thank you for watching this